Hey what's up everybody it's your girl Jersey and today we're going to be doing a tomato herb grilled cheese sandwich. This is so easy and delicious. I tell y'all this every week you can cook like a pro and with like minimal effort. This is a delicious comforting sandwich that can be accompanied by any soup preferably tomato because you know cheese goes good with tomato soup. So I'm going to show you how to make it. It's a few simple ingredients and we're going to get started. So first we need some Asiago bread if you can find it but if you don't if you can't find the Asiago bread you can use any kind of bread that you like um you want to butter each side well actually one side of the bread you want to butter one side of the bread so this ensures that the bread is crusty and brown once you go into the grilled cheese mode okay so then after you've buttered everything then you want to sit both pieces of bread inside of your non-stick skillet non-stick skillet helps you cook the most beautiful grilled cheeses ever. After you've done that, you wanna put your tomatoes in. So there's your tomatoes. And then you wanna add your cheese, cheddar cheese, help whatever cheese you like, but I use cheddar cheese today. You can use whatever one you want. And then after that, you wanna put a little onion. And I know my like vegetarian, vegan friends always ask me to do more vegetable things. So if you're one of those people, you could stop right here after we add this, the, uh, herbs on here which is the oregano salt and pepper that was the seasoning I put and then I put a little thyme you could stop right here you could shut the grilled cheese and it would be good but not me because I'm not vegan or vegetarian I'm gonna put bacon on this because I break the rules bacon so that's a little apple smoked bacon I put that on top and then after we do that we're gonna wait till that other piece gets brown the other piece of bread gets brown and then we're gonna shut it but of course you know how to let y'all get up in this pot so y'all can see what's good see that asiago cheese pocket right there that cheese pocket though that cheese pocket though oh delicious so then you just put the uh piece of bread on top see crusty brown delicious put it on the top and then at this point which a lot of people tend to leave the heat on i don't I put the sandwich in the middle of the pot and then I put on a tight fitting lid and I trap the heat in to melt the cheese. Turn off the stove or whatever you're using and then you come up with this beautiful delicious meal. So this like other recipes will be available on jadalauscious.com. Remember I'm here every Monday and Friday. Happy cooking. Be the best possible version of yourself. And I will see you next week. Please, if you do make this recipe, hashtag Jadalicious on Instagram, Facebook, wherever. And I can find it to see what you guys are doing in your kitchen. See you guys next week. Bye.